Hello again from Mishwa. This video is all about learning how to upload CEUs to your member registry profile so we can review and approve them. So I want you to remember that we access the member registry directly through our Mishwa.org website. So if you go to Mishwa.org, you want to make sure you're logging in here by scrolling over to the right and scrolling down here to log in. Make sure that you have um, remembered your password, your email address that we've migrated you or newly added you with, and go ahead and log in. This is how you know you have successfully logged in. And if you never click log out here, you know that you can always log back in rather easily. In order to view your profile, upload CEUs, or manage your account, all you have to do is click this orange person directly at the top. So I'm going to click him and here you'll be able to see that you can see my name and my um, last name. And also, if ever you see that there's something wrong with your county, you can click this drop down and go ahead and select the correct one or enter a brief description about who you are. But this video is all about uploading CEUs. So if I remember correctly from my CEU fact sheet, I know that I must maintain 20 CEUs over the next um, CEU period, which is about two years. So I need to go ahead and provide proof of my credits. So last year I attended Mishwa's eighth annual meeting. So I'm gonna go ahead and type in that title. I remember that that was about four hours and the description is it was Mishwa's eighth um, annual meeting. That's a brief description enough since it was our annual meeting that straightforward. The date was 10-22-2020, so that's in here properly, and this date is within my two-year period. And now here you have to have proof of completion. So all you need to do is upload a PDF, and this is my annual meeting certificate that was delivered by the Mishwa team, and I'm going to go ahead and submit. Once I do this, it was um, noted that it was added successfully. If I need to add another one, I'm going to go ahead and click Add Submission, and then I'm going to go ahead and try to add another one. Once I um, have submitted it, what you can see is that my email just ticked up one. So successfully, a CEU submission was sent. This is how I know that there is proof that my Mishwa certificate was sent for approval and that I have about two days to give the Mishwa team some time to review and approve that. Once it has been approved, I will receive another email that says it's been added to my profile. So just remember that you're giving us two days. Once you receive an automatic email, so are we, that says you got an email and a submission that you need to approve and our Mishwa team will do so. So that's just as easy as it is. You can go ahead here and submit another one if you um, attended the Spectrum Um CHW conference, you can add that. I think that was six CEUs, and you can say that was the 13th annual CHW conference for Spectrum. As long as this is within your CEU period, it will be reviewed. I think that was 8 13 2020. But remember, if I don't have proof, I cannot upload it. So, uh oh, I can't. So I'm going to just get back out of there and I'm going to leave that be. And maybe I need to edit my profile again. Maybe I want to add some more information, my LinkedIn page, my job title, or do something else here. But that's essentially everything you need to do for uploading any CEUs to your account. If you want to manage your account by adding a payment information, or change your password, you can do so directly here. Your membership information is here. If you wanna add a payment before this date, you do so here. But this is essentially how you navigate, edit, and upload your CEUs to your membership registry profile. I hope you think it's as easy as we do. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns related to maintaining your certification and your training, feel free to email pfisher at mishwa.org or as always, info at mishwa.org and we will be happy to help you. Have a good one. Thanks.